Welcome to the opening round of Valorant competition here at the Collegiate Esports Commissioner's Cup 2024 presented by McDonald's of North Texas. At the number 12 seed, please welcome to the stage Boise State University. The starting lineup for the Broncos, Daimyo, Skelesis, Prestige, Master, Rariana. All right, we're going to start over here with you. All right, heard you guys, you got a little sibling rivalry. Is that what I can call this? What are the thoughts on that? So we played each other a bunch. We kind of had their number in CCC, and they've had our number in CVAL for this year. So we're just hoping for a good match, and we've had a long history with them, and it should be a good game. Ooh, all right, we're finally getting the approach through. Side spin left inside of that mid position, so that late lurk that can TP over the tripwire if they need to. But they're still seeing that struggle from GC towards actually making it on to the site itself. Wait a minute, Skelesis! Ready to fight, hitting all the clean shots that they possibly can. Looking like they want to whip out the classic, go for the 3K, maybe make that the fourth. But whatever, regardless happens here, Boise winning out on their buy round pretty convincingly. A lot of pressure they're going to try and put on you, but said the tripwire is going to do all of the work for Rariana. Press them, quick spray through. Don't want to be found just yet. Finally going to meet them, make the swing to get the trade. So 4v4. Now their kind of attention's been splintered, this flank from Boise State Car starting to come in as that plant will go through. No more Gecko, so no Thrash online as a bonus plant strategy. You have to lean into this Thrash's ability to concuss, to delay, but Daimyo, some nice movement, gets one, and they are holding on. The Serpent choking out these players on site. The last to stand, the last to fall out of a heroic 4K from Daimyo. We'll get the job done. We'll keep it you know, fairly clean. First rifle around there. Uh, tech pause has concluded was the fact that we could see a rematch in the lowers. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, we're already having a fight in mid. Brilliant work from Boise though, to survive and meet the rising tide of GCU. Only two players left, that mid, disastrous for them. Spike is at least gonna be planted, but rotating around, dogs could go in, it's gonna be broken. You gotta do whatever you can to try and equalize the numbers. Dino's doing it! Finally they fall, last man standing, bolts. Only a stinger to their name, Boise. Boise, Boise, Boise. Defuse comes through. Fourth round done. Now, I mean, as a standstill, do you plant? You know the rotations have come through at this point. You know you don't have that perfect weapons advantage. Daimyo. <laughs> oh, no my way! God! Are you kidding? No, don't! It can't be like this, Daimyo! But it is! The thinnest of margins, Obi. You crouch under the tripwire and catch them completely off guard. You've seen how the Boise retakes in, but how's it going to be without your sky? I mean, this many members on site as well for Grand Canyon. Two tucked away here towards the generator. Daimyo none the wiser as well here, but again, forward pressure out of the duelist, out of Dino. And I talked about it before. I was going to be nervous about three members main on the B site. Well, eh? They took the fight to them, maintaining that position, that site, and you know, getting around if they desperately needed, like I said. Look at this from the shadows, this disruption that could come out from sight for now. You have no time to address it. You just have to go all in. You know that time's not of your best friend. Showstopper invested. They have nice forward pressure, but again, now you're fighting a war on it two fronts. Prestige stepping up for the squad, but they have to reload at some point. It's a 2v1. This recycle of the fault line could be all the difference, but no, Prestige, the hero 3k. But is there enough time? It is so close. 1.1. Oh my Ooh. goodness. Silent game. Tactical espionage simulated Valorant. Now we're finally going to get the ripcord pulled. Fault line used. There's Dizzy as well. Daimyo ready for the paranoia. Out goes Stalesis. They're the one with the Vandal, but no impact to be found from them. In fact, they've all of the picks, all of everything going to Grand Canyon University. A 2v4. Starting to hear the sound of the thrash make its way known. Don't even need to worry about that. Dino clean on these shots. One more for the roadblock. GCU has the fifth round taken care of. Utility being committed from both sides. Vault's gonna send little man. Daimyo safe in the corner, not gonna be seen there. 
but clean headshots, clean attacks. Invis picks up the one, but Poise has the two. Amio's hanging out on the other side. Rariana, the pistol, god themselves. It never feels like they falter or they feel any of that pressure, but Nader walks in, undeterred, unstoppable, until Master proves that even the most determined of individuals can be stopped. Hanging out in this gym position, Envy's had no HP. It's a clean 3k here for Rariana, and a clean second pistol round for Poise. Wait, throws the paint shell, pushed away by the aftershock. Envy set up around the other side. Master has the headshot there. Flashed out. They're gonna try and be the bulwark. Envy's classic is operating at a different level. Mine doesn't do that, that much oh. for sure. You're seeing right there, they're gonna try and do it again. 1v1! Stipe had to have done it themselves, and they saved the day here. What a way to do it as well. And Peter only has 24 HP. They know exactly where this final remaining member of Boise is hiding. Prestige has nowhere to go, and they have to make it work with a sheriff. And it's possible, of course, as long as they land those headshots, but it is going to be one heck of a battle that Nader is not going to lose. Not today, not now. GCU, one more round to go before it's 8-8. Eight to eight. Even through this, they're not going to go too far away. Instead, readjusting to try and go through the Boise spawn. Blinded, brilliant blind, but even brilliance is not gonna be good enough to stop Rariana and Prestige. Looking over towers there, feels like everyone on Boise is making their own voice heard. And the extra cherry on top is that Cypher Ultimate. Now they're getting even more creative, more proactive, searching for these rotations, not giving any time for coordination between Cypher and Nader for a potential retake option. I said retake might be where Grand Canyon University thrives, and that is a prime example of that coming into fruition. They took a page out of Boise State's book, going for that B main pop, and it is shut down in an instant. A f GCU, they have a trap place set up on that B side. As soon as the exec, the showstoppers pop, paint shell would go out, and then you would try and divide these players with the paranoia with a fault line. Unfortunately, though, again, just some Spidey sends an wait, ideal wait, wait, wait. call. It's a Sipe? fake. Sipe? has a judge right there on the other side of the wall. And Scalisis actually uses the showstopper to get the pick off on Dino on the other side of the map. But Sype hit the inside of the smoke. Could make some form of an impact, but too far away. And as someone walks out there, the paranoia blinds them, but so it's counted out as well. They only get the one, but it may be just enough. No, it's not. It's Damio. It's all his world, and we're just lucky yeah. enough to live in it right now. But Satchel with a bazooka of all things in uh, to market and even got the frag there. They don't recognize that they're getting pinched. Sis, you sneaky devil. They're gonna get one you know, or two. Like this, they have to know, they, they do realize that eventually oh, when they're pulling up the utility. Oh. That was the wrong moment, the wrong time to do it. They knew that someone was right there. They made the call out. It just was a little too late. Now the second layer, the first step of this retake, gather information from the from the shadows, and now your teammates with all of this initiator utility re-execs in and oh that's a team flash. That's up. that's oh you know someone's gonna be yelling at someone right now. But Boise's yelling at the top of their lungs. Attack us! We dare you! And GCU is hemorrhaging right now when it comes to their economy. They're leaving Nader That's inside early. of this. And they're going to go ahead yet, yeah, popping it up. And in fact, it's going to be Ancient Kind, but Nader may have it here. Rariana, so close. Nader at least had the first headshot there, but Rariana does go down. And that, along with it, the Vipers pick. GCU is fighting back hard with the weaponry that they have. And they have the numbers advantage. No way. They use the Showstopper. They use the Stingers. It's all about playing in their face. And they're ready to throw it back in their face along with that. A thrifty round. Pretty much complete control of the site. No one cleared towards this market, though. They're going to get out of there. Nader's going to get the headshot on the Prestige. Looking around, the Neural Theft is going to come in. Daimyo's been found out, but not caught by the Paranoia. The little man's going to be broken. Daimyo's going to go in there with the Satchel, distracting them long Whoa. enough for the rest of GCU to capitalize. And how much does Galisas do in a 1v4? Just the one. GCU closing the gap, little by little. In the meantime, how, how did Nader survive that? Oh, well, Nader's not surviving that. Skelesis. Putting forth a show of force. It is going to be traded out by Volt. They really, you're leaving behind Skeletus to take this fight in mid. They go through the cage. He was by themselves. Volt using Daisy, but it's a 2v1. Skeletus at least is going to be able to avenge their fallen comrade of Master. The GCU is swarming onto the site. Damio looking for that battle, looking for that duel. The Dino is just going back and forth. Goes for the wide swing. And GCU. Again, a one round 
differential. Chance for Boise as well to collect themselves. I mean, their weapons aren't the best here coming out of that uh, loss. Then you talked about denying momentum. They already have three rounds in a row, so this is a chance to get back on track to closing out sunsets. I, I think we're gonna go back to 1311. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie to you. Wait a minute. Oh, Sipe was right there. I saw it. Playing with fire, round after round. Yeah, you're playing with fire, and they're just getting burned. It, it's unfortunate for them. You've lost sight. Now you've lost your smokes to go along with it. And for Boise, this is kind of using Daimyo to check and see what's happening on B. Maybe to fake them out, because Boise still wants oh. to fight on A. Yeah, I love how much information this toxic screen robs them of. It still allows them to take control over elbow. The issue is that's now what's going to get re-cleared by this Dizzy, re-cleared by Volt and Envies. And now they've prepared themselves for an oncoming battle, but zoning. Oh, crazy that they still want to take these fights. Damio tearing them all down one by one piece oh. by piece. Where are you going to go, Dino? You tried to go up there, Rariata. The internal understanding of this game in full force. Boise in full force. Match point. GC, you have a time to retake. And they have Thrash on lane. They have everything they need to get this round on the table. Damio this time around is going to be the initial first blood here. It's traded out. Both Omens now gone. Masters fighting through. They're putting it all on oh. the table. One last person. Nader, all eyes on them. But it's a prestige moment. It is a Boise State moment. Map number one, the only map of Sunset, 13 to 10, Boise State, moving on. What a way, right? Sunset has been your map every single time, and the streak is unbroken. <laughs> oh, we love all the selfies. You got to celebrate. I mean, like Nerdy said, they're just happy to be here. They've been playing for fun all season, just working on team chemistry and mindset. And that's now paid off into a grind set that has gotten them here and now gotten them one step closer to the playoffs.